I know, we're going to the mall. Oh, okay. We're going to the mall. Oh, okay, perfect. I just want to let you know we got cameras up here. I'm making quick, so you're welcome. Nice car. Thank you. Talk about timing. <laughs> <laughs> Red Bull a day keeps the bank overdrafts away. <laughs> Hi guys, so I was gonna try and film the video on the roof just because it's a cool view, it's a cool little spot um, to record at, but we got shot down by security before we even got <laughs> before we got there basically. Um, so we're off to a little workspace. I'll sit down and I'm gonna tell you guys why I think starting a business with someone else when you're first getting started in the business scene is a terrible idea. Alright. Alright guys, so you're probably thinking like you know, oh, Thais is saying you start a business with someone else, you're gonna fail. Like, what are you talking about? You can make a lot of money with people doing, you know, business ventures together, right? And that's absolutely the case. But I'm talking about if you first, like, when you're first getting started, in, like, when you first hit the scene, a lot of you guys are looking for partnerships. You're trying to reach out to people to do stores with, um, to launch projects with, right? Um, and I, I was, you know, I, I was at full. I did this too. Like, I tried to first start, you know, with other people. And that's a mistake, okay? Yes, down the road, once you are familiar in the industry, once you are, um, you know, once you've done projects, once you have experience built up, you can look for other people for collaborations, you can look for them for partnerships to like do stuff that you can't um, and stuff like that. But the problem that I found, right, when people are first getting into any, any business, right, but especially dropshipping, e-commerce, all this stuff, and they're trying to find partners, they're trying to find people to, you know, collab on stores with and stuff like that, is that most of the time they're doing that because one, you don't want to do all the work, okay? Two, you don't have all the experience that you're just trying to find someone else to do that for you, okay? Or three, you just want to don't, you don't want to have all the pressure on yourself, okay? And like, I don't want you guys to bullshit yourself here because you got to be real with yourself, okay? And most people, right, they're, they're looking like you need, especially if you're brand new, okay? Especially if you're brand new, you need to start by yourself so you can fail and figure out, you know, everything that you need to know, everything that you don't know yet that you're about to find out by doing it yourself, okay? Most people, you, you're trying to partner with someone, you're trying to, you know, find someone else to do this for you, find someone else to do that for you, um, find someone to do this sort of work for you. Um, and yeah, like, it's, it's good thinking, but you're not at that, you're not at that stage yet where, where, you, where you're able to, okay? Or where, where you, you should be able to, like, manage all these people um, or, you know, find, you know, the proper, like, um, like partnerships, right, to, to actually go in with. So, like the biggest thing with that is, you know, because like when when I go to these events or whatnot, when I speak at these events in in Los Angeles, we've done you know events in Vegas, New York, Chicago, um, all this kind of stuff. Is I'll go there and when when we just like especially when when the event just starts and everyone's just t networking and talking and whatnot, right? People are like, oh, what do you do? Um, I, I drop ship. Oh, you drop ship too. Stuff like that. And they're like, yo, we should partner on a store. But the thing is like. They're both beginners. Like I, this was literally a case. Okay, it was in Chicago. All right, someone was talking to someone else. I overheard the conversation because we're just standing there chilling, like like asking, like people are asking us questions and whatnot. Um, and they're like, "Yo, we should partner on a store." And I'm just like, "Wait, guys, you both are very new to the industry. Okay, you both don't know what you're really doing yet. Okay, yet you both want to combine forces and you know launch a really profitable store together." And you know, there's always cases where like that can be the case, but 95% of the time, guys, if you start with someone else who also is fairly new or doesn't know what they're doing, or you know, you don't know what they know or what they don't know, right? You're gonna launch that with them, and then once, like, you're expecting them to hold some sort of end of the bargain, right? You're expecting them to be at some sort of like stage with it, and that's not the case, and you're not at uh, you know, at any particular level either, okay? So that's like the biggest point that I'm trying to get across, is that. Most of the time, guys, you should not be looking to start with someone else for your first few projects, okay? You need to do it yourself. You need to figure out what you know and don't know about marketing. You need to figure out like all these little small little things that, that need to be figured out for yourself so that you get familiar with the industry, okay? Because me, myself, I get like hundreds of DMs a day and people are like, yo, I want to partner with you on a store. You know, you can take, you know, 35% of the profits. You can take 60% of the store, um, you know, as long as you like, if, if we just partner up and I'm just like, okay, well, if you look at it, like they're literally just asking me to launch a store. They don't want to do any of the, the, the work or they don't know what they don't need. Like they don't know what they need to do. 
they want me to do it all for them and then take 40% of, of a cut, right? And like, I get they're looking for partnerships, I get they're looking for help, and they may not have like the, the biggest budget for them to experiment, but that's where you need to start. Like you need to figure out and mess up and fail fast and fail forward, as like you know Gary Vaynerchuk says. Um, that's just things you guys need to do. And again, I don't want to make this video too long or too repetitive. It's just sort of like a like a rant in a way. Um, but I like I want to make that clear because I don't want you guys to bullshit yourself. Like the biggest lies are the ones you tell yourself. Okay, those are the ones that are going to actually affect you the most. Is the shit that you tell yourself. Okay. And a lot of you guys out there are looking for other people to turn to or to, to like alleviate the pressure because yeah, business is stressful, okay? The pressure we put on yourself, the pressure you put on yourself when you're starting a business and all these like different deliverables, all these things you need to execute on, there's a million things going on all the time. There's like, there's a lot of pressure, right? You're looking for other people most of the time just to like, like alleviate some of that, okay? Like, oh, this is your fault, this is my fault. Um, and that's, that's, that's the problem that, that, that we see with a lot of people that, that try to find partnerships and whatnot. Um, right off the bat, okay guys, so again like now now like if I'm starting a business I do look for partnerships, okay, but I look for partnerships because like I know what I don't know Okay, I know what I suck at and I know that I can find people that are really fucking good At the stuff that I suck at and the stuff that I'm good at I do without question Okay, and then from there we're actually able to like be like, okay, this is your skill set. This is my skill set This is how we split the business this is how we're gonna go about doing things all right, now, now that's, that's a really solid venture. You both know what you're doing, okay? And that's how you make a really, really successful company with someone else, all right? So again, guys, this was just a very, very quick little video rant. Um, but I just wanna like, basically like, tell you guys, like, you, like, especially like, cause a lot of you guys are beginners, okay? A lot of you guys are just getting into the space. A lot of you guys are just figuring out what e-commerce is um, or drop shipping or private label, any of that stuff. Um, but don't try and just find some other people to do it with, okay? Because really deep down at the core, you're most likely just trying to find other people so that you don't have to learn everything yourself or you don't have to do everything yourself. Um, and when you're first starting out, that's something you need to do. All right, guys, so that, that was the video. Um, make sure to leave a like, okay? Make sure to drop a comment. I respond to everybody's comments. And don't forget to subscribe, guys. I will see you guys in the next video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Um, we're not on the rooftop, unfortunately, because we got kicked out. But um, I'll see you guys in the next one. All right, guys, take care. Yeah.